but during his term, uh, in his tenure, I mean, in the assembly. And so I actually did want to take a little bit of time to call your attention to some of the issues that he has worked on on our behalf, because you might not know how much he's doing. In 2015 and 16, he authored Assembly Bill 1863, which added marriage family therapist to the list of Medi-Cal eligible providers who could bill for services. Yes, let's have a big round of applause for that. Um, thank you. As we all know, mental health is, and services are really, really needed in our community. And um, having the ability to hire marriage family therapists and get paid for their services was really a game changer for a lot of the community health centers. Um, we haven't quite implemented yet. Working on it. We're working on it, see? Still working on it. The, the uh, implementation of the bill was delayed by Governor Brown's administration, but we are working on making it happen soon and shortly, right, Jim? Yeah, okay. <laughs> So, um, I'll talk to you later, John. <laughs> Assemblyman Wood has also um, steered many, many other pieces of legislation related to health care delivery, including bills to prevent patients from unfair billing practices, allowing interns to provide mental health counseling under supervision, improving the Dentical program, addressing the opioid epidemic, increasing oversight of the pharmacy benefit managers. I know it's a little technical, but these are all really, really important things to us. And he also uh, authored a bill that um, required the state to prepare a feasibility analysis of a public health option. And this is really just a partial list of his accomplishments uh, in the, just in the healthcare space. And that doesn't count all the other things that he's done for the environment, for education, for rural broadband, another favorite topic of mine. Uh, the, he's uh, worked on emergency response bills. The list really goes on and on. And right now he's actually working on directing some flood recovery funds to the Russian River area. So let's give him a really big hand.